So the first thing you want to do is just go to this website, Pangu.io, and you're going to click on Mac right here. So once you click on that, it's going to automatically start downloading. As you can see, it'll start right there, but I've actually already started this and finished it actually. And I've saved it to my desktop. So we're going to go to my desktop right here. And all you need to do is make sure that your device is plugged in, as you can see right here. And I'll show you that I am on iOS 7.1.1. Click on About, and you can see 7.1.1. So now we're going to go ahead and open up Pangu. And then open it up again right here. And if you get an option where it won't open because it's from an un unidentified developer, then you're just going to right click on this and then click Open. And then you will be able to open this application up. And you'll notice in this version that it's actually in English, which is pretty nice. They've also removed that third party software, as you can see right here. There's no checkbox for that, so you don't have to worry about that this time. So, all you need to know is that this is plugged in and it's being recognized, as you can see right here. So, once it's plugged in, you're ready to go. Go ahead and click jailbreak. All right, so now you're going to actually have to change the date. So we did this in the last jailbreak, if you guys watched that. So we're gonna go into our settings, and then we're going to go back, and we're gonna tap on general, and then we're gonna scroll down to date and time. Tap on that, and then we're going to untoggle set automatically. And we're going to set our date right here. So let's go ahead and set it back to June 2nd. And then tap general again and it should automatically start. As you can see right here, it's injecting bundles. So let it go ahead and do its thing. And when it pops up right here, that says please tap the Pangu icon on your device to continue. Just make sure you go to your springboard here. We're gonna swipe over and you'll notice a Pangu icon. We're gonna tap on that. And it says, are you sure you wanna open up this application, Pangu, from developer? Of course we do, let's tap continue. And it's gonna automatically start as you can see right there. So this is only going to take a few minutes, so go ahead and sit back, try not to touch your device, and let it do its thing. I'll go ahead and speed this up for you guys. Alright, so you can see that when it boots up for the very first time and it's actually jailbroken, you'll notice on the software on your Mac that it says this is already jailbroken, that's why you get that red text. So now we can just unlock our device, swipe over, open up Cydia. And you can see that it's going to start to prepare the file system. So this is what you have to do every time that you freshly jailbreak your new device. So we're going to prepare the file system and then we'll be good to go. Alright guys, so now we're booted up and Cydia should be prepared. So if we swipe over here and open that up, you can see that we are good to go and you can start downloading tweaks and installing those.